Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am your host, Saucy McBoodlefist, and today we are playing a game called Dealer's Life. And I know nothing about this game, so let's just get started with it, shall we? Um, what is your level of competence, charisma, insight, and luck? Um, I'm gonna say I've got good charisma. Okay, let's just do one of each. And I wouldn't say I'm lucky, but let's go with insight. I don't know. And what's my name? Saucy. Okay, let's go. Tutorial tip. It's morning. The working day is about to begin. In this phase of the game, you can manage things like move to a new shop, hire and fire employees, increase your skills, and perform actions on items. Remember that once you open up the shop, you won't be able to do such things until the next morning. Okay. Look for a guy to hire. Restore for hire. Shop for rent. Expert for hire. Um... Saul Kim is looking for a new job. It's always good to have someone lucky in your shop since luck passively becomes yours. Okay, let's hire him. You just hired a new lucky guy. Um, nice shop located in the commercial district. Okay, I don't have enough money. Okay, um, your shop is open. You can always tap your first customer in the queue to get details about, hold on. This is not a normal customer. Pay much attention to such encounters as they could greatly influence your influence the game depending on what you decide to do. Remember that there are always hidden choices unlocked only when specific conditions are met, okay? Um, you, you can always tap your first customer in your queue to get details about them on ta or tap the item on the table to get details about what your customer has to buy or sell. Wow, someone... Wow, someone did finally buy this shack after all. Nice to meet you. I'm the next door pawn shop owner. The best pawn shop in town, just to be clear. Okay. That's right. Did you really open a pawn shop here without here without caring about me uh, working next door? Ha! Huh, you're already doomed. What I see at this moment is just a poor novice. According to my fame media, your the fame level is the lowest I've ever seen. Ha! Huh, you don't even know about what I'm talking about, do you? Fame level is really what matters in in our business. It grants you big deals, money, and well, fame. Only by improving your abilities and by moving more prestigious shops can you increase your fame level, but I bet you won't even manage to become a beginner. Hi, my name is Ronnie Burbutton. I want... I like that item. I really want it. Okay, wait. Can I click on him? Don't know anything about him. Okay, uh, let's see. Collectible book, produced in 2013. Rarity, common. Condition, very good. Estimate, $490. Uh, let's deal. Now you can have it with your customer to make the best deal you can. To change the value you can offer, uh, you can use the blue buttons on the bottom right of the screen. Alternatively, you can put a specific value by tapping on the white button linked to the arrows. Tap B to make your offer and X to quit your negotiation. Okay. Um. Mm. I'm not entirely satisfied, but I'll accept it. Nice. Okay. Hey man, I'm Lionel Singer. I saw that gym over there. 
give it to me. Some tricks are missing because of your low insight. Okay. Uh, collective, collectible rifle produced in 1990. Rarity, uncommon. Condition, terrible. Estimate, 990. Okay. Are you crazy? I'm thinking about 770. Hmm. I think we're going nowhere here. I think I'll leave now. Good morning. You can call me Austin Smith. I can't get my eyes off that pizza over there. I've got big cash for you. Okay. At the end of each day, the report you show your stats uh, for the day. Remember that every seventh day, you'll have to pay your weekly expenses, so make sure you have enough money. Okay. Um, what do these buttons do? In this section, you can view all the employees you have hired. From here, you can also fire them or stop the tasks that they're doing. In this section, you can manage your items. Remember, the more unlocked items you have in your inventory, the more buyers you'll have in your shop. Also, you can have more items that attract more customers. Where? Common, rare, epic, legendary, mythic. Okay. In this section, you can manage your character's skills by increasing your skills. Your pay level will grow and you encounter more and more precious items. Keep in mind that employees' effects do not increase your fame level. In the left page of the section, you can view your shop's details. In the right page, you can see list of events related to taking place today. All right. Hi, you can call me Daniela Brown. I desire that piece over there. Give it to me or I'll be very sad. Uh, trophy produced in 2020 belong to tank and fizz, the devs of the game, legendary, condition very good, 2050. Yeah, I got it. Hey, what's up? Name's Melania Korb. I'd like to show you a unique piece that you could tickle that that could tickle your interest. Console video game produced in 2016. Uh, rarity common, very good. Estimate 275. Okay.
nice. Alright, well, let's get started. Hey, what's up? I'm Wood Takei. I've got something. Take take a look and tell me what you... Th tell me what you want. Tell me you want it, okay? Uh, metal produced in 2016. Common, very good. Estimate 290. Okay, let's deal. Hey, my name is Kelly Bridges. I've got a little treasure. I want you. I want to get rid of it. Hmm. Hey man, I'm Fred Hilfiger, and I found something now that I want to sh that you'll shower me with money with. All right, let's see. Oven produced in 2015, uncommon, terrible condition, estimate 305. Okay, let's deal. I'm thinking 400. How about? They call me Wayne Douglas Tucker. I saw that gym over there. Would you sell it to me? Okay, I paid 400 for it. It's worth 290. Oh no! Oh, I totally screwed this up. Good morning, my name is Jeanette Tweak. And I'm thinking about buying that, that piece over there, ready to take my money. Collectible gold coin produced in 2016. Condition terrible, estimate $610, okay. Oh man, I'm not doing too good. Local indie team sued for including their game. Too many references to the TV show last week today from Johnny Olivero. Mother continues mission to find his son. Her mission to find his son, who has gone missing since last Christmas. Santa's the major suspect. All right, let's get started. Uh... Hello, my name is Vin Ollie, and I just fell in love with that item. 
ready to take my money. Man, I am... Man, I'm dumb. I really screwed this up. Hey, what's up? Name's Bonnie Ryan. I'm here to get. I'm here for that item. Give it to me. Uh. Okay, let's deal. I don't think we'll ever come to agreement with this. I'm leaving now. Hello, my name is Darius O'Brien. I really need to buy that piece over there. I'll let you think about it. Man, I'm not doing good. Parallel lines have so much in common. It's a shame they will never meet. Okay, yeah, I really don't care about any of that stuff. Good morning. Name's Brian Hannigan, and I found a little treasure now that you'll shower me with money. Uncommon. Terrible. Estimate 600. Alright, let's deal. Rebecca Garibaldi, I want to sell you something. It will fit wonderfully in your shop. A skateboard. Condition terrible. Estimate 168. Okay, I will... I'm here to give you an item. I've got cash. Okay. According to our president, a peace treaty was signed today in Air Arstotska. It went well, he said. We signed a document about forcing Arstotska to peace using war. Hey, isn't that a reference to uh, papers, please? Alright, let's get started. I don't really care about the news. Okay, I want to buy something. Let's see. Okay. Hello, they call me Dorian Testaburger. I saw that piece over there and I really want it.
Good morning, my name is Kate Brightaxe, and I'd like to purchase that piece over there. I've been looking at it for ages. Okay, the gigantic poster, I paid $375 for it. Estimate, $600. Are we going to talk about numbers? Hey, what's up? My name, they call me Kate Carver. I just saw that piece over there. Okay, I paid... I can't believe that I paid 400 for that. Let's deal. Let's see if I can make $10, $10 off of it. $2.50. Hello, my name is Philomia Tancredi, and I've got something that I want in exchange for money, you know? Okay, an old decorated sword. Produce an 1828 rare estimate. Very good, 8900. Alright, sorry for the silence there for a second. I was just looking at something. We are going to end the episode off here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you all in the next one. Uh, goodbye, everyone.